us covering the upper Midwest. Today's feature of the day is going to be the straining system found on this Rogator C-Series liquid system. So the straining system on here consists of two strainers on our standard volume system. Inside you'll find a 30 and a 50 mesh strainer. There are no other strainers on the machine in the product flow. On our high volume machine, we'll have just a single high flow strainer with a 30 mesh screen inside. These strainers come with a quarter turn valve on the bottom of the bowls to allow you to clean them out very easily. So you can do it more often. You don't have to take the strainer apart. Now the big difference in how we set up the straining system on the C-Series versus our competitive or older model machines is like I said, these are the only strainers on. Other machines you'll find strainers across the boom, usually one for each boom section. So on a 120 foot boom you could have five, seven, nine strainers out there. Now the issue that you'll run into is that not all the strainers will plug up at the same rate or at the same time. So you'll have some strainers with higher restriction in them than others. Now the way the system works is after it goes through the flow meter, it's pretty much a path of least resistance to get that product out of the booms. So if it's harder to get product through a strainer, easier to get through another one, you're gonna find areas of the boom, a section of the boom that are gonna be under applying, and others that are gonna be over applying. So even though the controller may show you applying the right rate, the right rate is not gonna be hitting the ground underneath that boom. Thank you for your time, and this has been our feature of the day.